everyone the topic for today is capital gain on sale of property now uh, if it is a personal property like uh, sorry if it is a PPR personal place of residence sorry principal place of residence then it is not taxable we are talking here about investment property you had investment property for maybe six months back you bought or you bought for few years back then it is taxable or not the sale is taxable or not now in case you have held that property investment property for less than 12 months then full amount of the capital gain will be taxed as an ordinary income there is no discounting or indexation full amount will be taxed okay now if the property is held for more than 12 months as you can see if if you if you hold if you have held the property for more than 12 months then there are two methods indexation and discounting but the rule of thumb is that uh, whatever is the capital gain you divide by half or you take 50 percent of that so that half amount will be included in your tax return and you pay tax on that which means let us say your capital gain is hundred thousand the cost of acquisition and you know sale price the difference is around hundred thousand but you held that property for six years so the long term capital gain will be hundred thousand divided by two which is fifty thousand that fifty thousand will be part of your income now it will be added to your normal income your salary or your business income and then you have to pay tax on that there is no fixed rate there is no standard rate on this uh, on this capital gain or uh, tax rate there is no like you know specific tax rate for this capital gain it will be added to your income if it is held for less than 12 months then it is tax as tax as in you know ordinary income you pay tax at the normal rate if it is held for more than 12 months then you pay tax at the normal rate but only 50 percent is included in the income okay thanks for watching See you in the next video. Bye.